If there is one thing that is truly astonishing about the Earth is the fact that even with all of our collective knowledge, new shocking discoveries are still left to be made. Today we're going to look at 10 recent discoveries that left scientists in shock. Let's begin, shall we? Number 10. Goliath the Tadpole. Now, tadpoles are tiny little things. On the average, they don't grow to more than a couple of centimeters long. They do get larger though, but that's when they finally stop being tadpoles and start being frogs. So just imagine the surprise when a group of scientists found a tadpole as big as a fish. Goliath, as he is now affectionately called, was discovered by a team of volunteers who were removing off invasive bullfrogs in Arizona. At first they thought it was a fish, but it didn't take long for what he exactly was to become apparent. Goliath was an American bullfrog, one of the largest frogs in the world, but that isn't the reason for its size. His absolutely gargantuan size actually comes from hormonal imbalance, the same kind of imbalance that produces extra large humans. To top it all off, he's still growing. How large is he gonna get is to anybody's guess, but it's safe to say that when we eventually find out, he's gonna be larger than life. And, well, kinda terrifying, honestly. Number 9. Time to rewrite the history books. Human history has just changed, forever. For the longest time, we've thought that our species goes back to as far as 200,000 years ago, the time when our first ancestors lived in Africa. But just recently, new studies have extended human history back to at least 150,000 years. This discovery is shocking because it has been conclusively proven that Homo sapiens are an older species than we previously thought. The discovery was made in Jebel Irod in Morocco. Quite interestingly, this is not a new archaeological site. Bones have been unearthed here since the 1960s, but previous studies have mistakenly identified the remains that were discovered here belong to Neanderthals. The most recent studies have shown that the bones taken from the site are in fact Homo sapien. And just like that, quite a few more chapters have been added to the book of human history. Number 8. Uranus smells awful. Alright, alright, come on. Get the giggles out. Come on, we're all adults here for the most part. Have you ever wondered what Uranus smells like? Ugh, yeah, I know how it sounds. It's hard to ignore the double entender here, but please stop being immature for a second and... Okay, just get it all out, hear me out. Again, the planet Uranus, have you ever wondered how it smelled? If your answer to this question is, yeah, well, clearly you have a very inquisitive mind. Or you just have too much time on your hands. Either way, scientists, however, have actively asked this question and have actually found out the answer. After years of extensive study and observation, using the most high-tech equipment available to man, they have collectively come to a conclusion. Uranus smells like rotten eggs. By observing the behavior of the clouds on Uranus' atmosphere, scientists have concluded that most of the atmosphere is composed of hydrogen sulfide, the same chemical that gives rotten eggs its distinct bouquet. Of course, any would-be traveler to Uranus would already be dead even before we can start worrying about the smell. Anyone even getting remotely near the upper atmosphere of Uranus would immediately suffocate. So, now you know that Uranus smells awful. What you do with this information is totally up to you, no matter what age you are. Or act. Number 7. Liquid Water on Mars. Given the size of the universe, it's not hard to imagine that there is or was other intelligent life out there. Proving that they are there, however, is a totally different matter. The limitations on our current technologies prevent us from, well, boldly to go where no man has come before. That's the reason why this entry in our list is so exciting. It brings us much closer to proving that life exists, or even existed outside Earth conclusively for the very first time. Just last year, the European Space Agency Marsis instrument detected liquid water beneath the surface of Mars. The discovery of liquid water on the Red Planet is shocking enough, but given the fact that water is one of the fundamental building blocks of life, the potential of discovering life on Mars, either past or present, is truly an exciting and possibly shocking prospect. Number 6. Detection of Gravitational Waves Albert Einstein is the most popular scientist on Earth, bar none. Heck, even the ones who only know a little bit about science will be familiar with his name and his famous equation, E equals MC squared. Even today, years after his death, we're still fascinated by his unique mind. Literally. 
As a matter of fact, modern day scientists are still studying pieces of his brain, desperately trying to find out if there is a physiological manifestation of being a genius. Not only that, most of Einstein's theories still hold importance to this very day, and the next shocking discovery in our list even proves one of them. Although Albert Einstein predicted the existence of gravitational waves back in the 1900s, it wasn't until 2016 that man finally managed to prove its existence. The scientists at Caltech kept track of the binary pair of neutron stars that according to general relativity caused gravitational waves. They formed LIGO, which can sense infinitesimally faint whispers of gravitational waves. Then in 2016, LIGO directly sensed the distortions in space-time caused by passing gravitational waves, generated by two colliding black holes nearly 1.3 billion light-years away. How was Einstein, who should have been a product of his time, able to think forward decades into the future, almost accurately predicting what today's scientists are just beginning to understand? We may never know, but what we know is he is truly an amazing man with an even more amazing mind. Number 5. World's Oldest Art Probably one of humankind's greatest mysteries is how did we humans come to make and learn how to appreciate art? How did the creative process evolve with our species? How did we stop from making rudimentary cave wall drawings and start making true art? This very recent discovery attempts to answer how and when. Recently, scientists found the world's oldest art in a cave in Borneo, an island in Indonesia. The figurative art could be dated back to over 40,000 years. They are older man-made images, but they only show lines and abstract patterns. However, they seem to depict wild cattle painted on the walls using iron oxide or ochre because it's an orangish color. Sue O'Connor, an archaeologist, said that art tells us about how it was more of a symbolic tradition rather than being regionally unique. Did these ancient people really leap forward in artistic expression? Or are we like the true art connoisseurs that we are, just looking far too much from a simple painting? Either way, we probably won't know, but I'm sure that red door means nothing. Number 4. Earth's Older Cousin Ever since the day Galileo first used his telescope to gaze at the wondrous objects in the sky, we have now come to know as the stars and planets, people have been wondering if we are truly alone in this vast universe. Today, however, we no longer use primitive telescopes. We're more capable than ever to answer that same burning question first asked hundreds of years ago, and a very recent discovery may have the potential of giving us a definitive answer. Scientists reporting from NASA's Kepler mission confirmed that a similar planet much like Earth's has been discovered. Although it is 60% larger than our Earth and is similar in terms of appearances, but it is still a huge accomplishment. It falls in the habitable zone, meaning being just in the reach of a sun-like star around which it also orbits. That means the temperature is just right for the possible existence of water. This planet has been named Kepler 452b. Number 3. Firehawks Bushfires are a natural occurrence, but with the current state of the climate, the threat of these raging infernos are getting more and more serious. The last thing people need right now is for some animals that not only take advantage of these fires to hunt for food, but actively spread the fire for their own benefit, as a recent study has uncovered. In Australia, some people notice certain bizarre visuals such as birds carrying smoldering bits of branches from places to place. According to the scientists who studied them, these fire hawks would salvage something brands from existing fires, drop it in a fresh patch of grass elsewhere, and wait for the melee of frightened prey to make a run for it. And they'd easily hunt them down. A little arsonists that they are. Aubergines have observed these birds for thousands of years, and is well documented through folk tales and legends. How do these birds learn how to harness fire? It's said that humans gained the evolutionary advantage by learning how to harness fire first. Are we witnessing the evolution of a new dominant species? This sounds horrifying, actually. Now do you want to get to know something that is truly amazing? Now it's time for the day's best pick. Number 2. Rock Hewn Chetty. The picture depicts a giant rock hewn chetty that is situated at Mes Ainyak, Afghanistan. The people who used to live there would follow Buddha and Shiva equally back in 900 CE. Mes Anyak is a major historical heritage site, which many of the statues still preserved. It has been called one of the most important points along the Silk Road by French archaeologist Philippe Marquis. Don't get me wrong, this site was discovered years ago, and you can't really call it recent. 
However, a very recent discovery is currently threatening the very existence of the Chetties, and future generations might not get a chance to enjoy their majesty. Unfortunately, a large deposit of copper was discovered around the site very recently. And now there is a struggle between history and industry, leaving archaeologists at a scramble to save this truly amazing discovery. I saved the best for last, but first, I have a quick challenge that takes only 5 seconds to complete. If you can leave a like and subscribe within the next 5 seconds, you'll get 10 years of amazing luck. Just try it, it really works. Number 1. The Blob do you remember The Blob, that 1988 horror movie about a shapeless mask going around town gobbling people around, and not the mutant from the X-Men? Would you believe me if I tell you that it no longer is confined to the world of fiction? Well, you shouldn't, because nothing exactly like that exists. However, a recent deep-sea discovery has uncovered something eerily similar. The recent discovery is called the Deep Staria, a kind of jellyfish that has been rarely observed. In fact, only a few specimens in the wild have ever been filmed. Its resemblance to the blob is uncanny. It can shapeshift at will, it moves quite sluggishly as well. It also eats exactly like the titular movie monster, by slowly approaching its would-be victim and then expanding its body to engulf its prey whole. Discovering something that is very similar to a classic movie monster is shocking enough, but keep this in mind, we haven't fully explored the depths of the ocean yet. Just imagine what kind of weird and amazing creatures we will discover in the future. Probably not the Megalodon. I'm pretty sure that thing's dead. Which recent discovery shocked you as well? Let us know in the comments section below. Want to watch more shocking videos about our world and beyond? Click on any of the videos you see on the screen. As always, everybody, thank you all for watching, and I will see you all next time.